Now we'll see the shopping cart, the big picture for shopping cart. When a person, he want to add a course for shopping cart, he will create the collection in Firebase shopping cart. And the user, he will receive the ID of shopping cart. This ID shopping cart will save it in local storage. So for each user has ID shopping card. So we don't need to be authenticate. So this is a big picture for shopping card. Now we go to our project. So here we have a different course. Here we are admin, so we can add a course and display the course and delete the course. Just uh, one thing we uh, we need. We need to display the price here for each course. So I forget to do that. So we'll do it now. So we come in courses, component and the list of courses. And here we will add the price. So for that we do span. And here we do perfect. We come back. So here it's the price. We apply still. So for that we do class price, for example. And we do a font size medium and blood. Perfect. We come back to Navigator. So is more better. And we want to be in the center. So for that we do, we can apply the FX layout. Perfect. So we have here, each core has uh, the price uh, for the course and it was uh, the course, the price for the course. Perfect. Now we come back for the uh, shopping cart. For the shopping cart, as you know, we create the module shopping cart. For that we create a folder shopping cart. And inside we component. and the service and model. And the app model. App. Dot TS. Perfect. Perfect. Now we added the model in app component. So here we added, we add the module of shopping cart. Perfect. Now we have created the shopping module shopping cart. Inside there is different component and different modules. Uh, here it's models and the different service. And he has it has the app module. Perfect. Now we go to courses, module courses, and here we have course and courses, so module courses. And for that, when we, when we click for add course, you have to add the shopping cart. And for that we do, it's very simple, click. Add to cart and inside the course. Perfect. We'll create this event and here we do like this. Perfect. And for that, we create a service for shopping card to added collection shopping card. 
So terminal, a new terminal, cd source, and for that we do ng generate service shopping cart. Perfect. So we go to shopping cart service, and here we create the function or the method add to cart. So we import Firebase database and who here we inject the DB, DB of perfect and here added to cart and receive course. And here we create our method to add a course to a cart. And for that, so we do let cart ID for local storage get ID cart ID. If cart ID is null, we will create that in database Firebase. So we do this DB, this DB list of shopping card. and we'll push so we'll push and here we do date created of new data get time perfect here we create collection shopping cart and inside we do the date the time to create shopping cart and when we create shopping cart we will have id of shopping cart and the id of shopping cart will save it in local storage and for that we do like this it's we do let cart here because it's return promise, so we do await, and here we do async. When we do await, you must to do async in the function. And for that, and for that we do local storage set item, which item it's card ID. and the cart dot k so now if the if we don't have the cart id local storage we will create it and we will save it in local storage perfect and for that we created a method provide method to add the course so we do and here if the cart is not so else if we have the id the cart id in local storage so just to call this so we do to do local storage get Perfect. So if we don't have the ID in local storage, we will create shopping card, collection shopping card in Firebase, in database, database Firebase, and we save it in the local storage. If we have ID local storage, we take it, we get it from local storage.
perfect now here we will add a course to a car so for that we do this db plus the id card plus items items is the courses and the plus the course dot k perfect and for the pipe when we create we take one so take one take its operator so here we import we import take so we do import perfect and for that if course not course dot k is not null uh, is null so we create the course in shopping cart so a hey, course k and course here perfect so course card here the k and course for course added perfect this is very simple so we look if we are we have a course in shopping cart if we don't have we added a course in shopping cart perfect and we come back to our to our courses and here we inject the service so we do like this private service shopping card of shopping card and here this dot shopping card added to card and for that we do course perfect so we try again we click for example java programming master class you click add course inspect there is a problem local storage dot set so we come back for that and it's local set item perfect and after we clean here and we added course perfect yeah there is hair yeah because they don't have so we do like this so course.k and for that so we come back we clean we clear and we add the first for example perfect no problem we go to firebase and here we have to shopping cart so is not normal so for that what we do we well, delete this and delete this perfect we come back to firebase we go to application and we delete local storage perfect so we try again so we add course we come back to so we have id card and we have item item it's the id of course and the course it's okay so we if we start again to add the second 
and perfect and we have the second course so this idea of shopping card he is saved in it's saved in application and we have card id so card id for each user perfect now we have shopping card id shopping card and the different item for, for for different course now we'll change uh, the next step uh, the next step will when we click when we click here we change the shopping card here the number of course 